Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Dr. Vanna Khalifa. I'm a PhD student at the Johnson Case Bloomberg School of Public Health. I was also a dual MPH and MBA SOMA scholar. Um, I've gone through the graduate school application process, getting admission to Harvard, Yale, Columbia, and the rest of the top schools. I've also helped several students get admission to these elite institutions. As you can see behind me, that's the iconic Johns Hopkins uh, Hospital, and I'm actually on the ninth floor of the Johns Hopkins Bloomberg School of Public Health. Um, so today we're going to talk about an essential element of your application process, especially for uh, international students. We're going to look at the World Education Services or transcript evaluation. Um, if you're an international student and applying to a US institution, especially public health, then it's most likely you're going to go through the World Evaluation or the World Education Services Evaluation. So stick with me. I'm going to show you how to create an account, how to add all your courses, and also how to request a transcript evaluation through your school. So stick with me, and I hope you will learn a lot from this video. Let's go. Okay, so um, as I said, um, another important aspect of your public health graduate school application uh, is the uh, World Education Services Evaluation. So if you're an international student, most certainly, and you're applying to a program in the U.S., most certainly you'll be asked to do an evaluation of your transcript, right? Um, so... Uh, you know, you what you have to do first is to create an account. But you can go through the West uh, website just to see what they do. But it's not important in this particular uh, uh, tutorial. So let's go straight to creating an account. So what you want to do is to go to get an evaluation. So you go to get an evaluation. And then to ask you, where will you use this evaluation? So I'm going to use it in the US. Put your email. Remember, your email should be legit. Um, so this is my email. And then they will send you a verification code, right? So they will send you a verification code and you use the code to... Uh, uh, confirm your account and then log in. Um, confirm your account. So I'm, I'm just grabbing the code, code quickly. So I have the code here. Put it here. Submit code. Great. So now our verification is complete. Okay. So this is where the real uh, work begins. Remember that OS evaluation is going to use your transcript and it's going to use your certificates. So you have to use the name that is on your certificate. So for example, Banda Khalifa, my last name is Khalifa, right? Um, if you don't have a family name, you select. Your date of birth, remember to put the correct date of birth um for the purpose of this you can pick 1999 as we used in our so fast application do you have a west reference number no create a password um as usual i like simple passwords um re-enter password security question uh what is your pet's name my pet's name is Jami. Okay. When you subscribe to us, no, I don't want to subscribe. So you create an account. Good. So now that we've created an account, we have to follow through the rest of the application. So uh, it says, how did you hear about West uh, University Admission Materials? Um, 
select your gender I'm a man uh, telephone we are using Ghana right don't call me this is a wrong number okay um, okay so now it's asking you what is the primary purpose of this evaluation the primary purpose is for education so select education what level of education graduate admissions okay and then we we'll go to next what credentials have you earned so if you have so this typically starts at the undergraduate level right um or you know whichever um credential you have but let's go on uh, so ghana type of education so they can do evaluation for your secondary education colleges of nursing and midwifery polytechnics teacher training colleges higher education so if you have an undergraduate degree and above you select higher education right and the name of institution is university of ghana the premier university the best university in ghana and the best university in west africa right so university of ghana and the name of diploma or certificate so what name or what is a degree name so uh, i believe it's bachelor of medicine and bachelor of surgery here right your first name as it appears on your certificate or your transcript right field of study i prefer to put clinical medicine because there's because there's herbal medicine right so you have to uh indicate it uh, yes year awarded when did you graduate this consistent um years attended from when to when so let's say from 2009 to 2016 right and then we'll save it okay so now this is what you have if you are applying to a phd um ideally you may have a master's degree if you are applying to a, um, a public health school so what you can do is to add another credential if if your master's is from the u.s you may not need to do this right if it's outside of the u.s then you have to add another credential for them to evaluate all your credentials okay all right so now let's go to the next okay so you have to add your address so let's add our mailing address um let's pick ghana p.o box 6547 city accra um delivery method standard you don't need it to be uh, a courier service you don't need to, like there's no agency in it especially the, the copy that is coming to you there's no agency so just pick the standard uh delivery okay um and then so have you seen that this is recipient number one so recipient number one is you once they are done with the evaluation they will send you a copy of the evaluation okay and then um uh, recipient two is the institution or the organization that needs your evaluation remember that when we created a sofas account our transcript needed to be evaluated so we will add sofas as a recipient to the final evaluation so let's add so far so I'll, I'll click add recipient and then i'll search for sofas search for sofas so one result found so we'll click sofas and you see so this is where i said you should take note of your cast id from sofas so we created a sofas account and then we got a cast id from sofas so what you have to put here is your so fast cast id so let me check what we have four seven 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 one three four seven all right so add this recipient okay so now we've added so fast to the list so once the evaluation is done they will send it automatically to so fast and then so fast will 
um, release it to the various schools or they, or they will put it on your file so that once so fast is sending your application to the other schools they would they would get it to the other schools so um yes so this is where uh, i think you would have to consider the the price but then you have no option if you're applying to graduate program in the u.s so currently the SOFAS application is 217 dollars right um so yeah it, it's just showing you what you have to do so what we are picking is a course by course evaluation at the end of this tutorial i'll show you an example of how it looks like once you your course by course evaluation is done right okay so let's go to the next part now this is also very very important right um uh, so this is going to show you exactly what you need to do in order for your transcript to get evaluated um, those days when i was doing my transcript evaluation we had to download a form fill that form and take it to university of ghana or take it to your uh, university in whether in nigeria in ghana or kenya for them to act on it but now it looks like SOFAS has gone digital SOFAS has gone electronic so um uh they they have they have established so it says west has established relationship with university of ghana and has provided the university officials with instructions right so please contact the university to send your documents electronically so now it's become even more easier you don't have to walk around campus looking for people to to help you f fill out um forms and and respond and then at the end of the day they have to mail it to so fast but now electronic delivery so it's it's quite easy right don't go to the university to 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 request for your transcript and then mail it yourself to so fast that will not be accepted so follow up with the with the school once you you are done setting up everything you've paid for everything follow up with the school and then um you can let them respond to to so fast uh, for your degree so you need your transcript and your degree for your degree if you have a legible photocopy you can upload it into your account uh, it doesn't really uh, need to be from the school uh, so the most important thing is the academic transcript that you have to follow up with the school degree certificate you can upload it if you have a copy right and then that that i think that is about it the rest is to make sure is to check and make sure that your name is correctly spelled your date of birth is correct right and the school information you have is also correct right our recipient recipient one is to yourself recipient two is to so fast uh, sometimes too if you're applying for a phd and you're doing so most of the p some of the phd programs may not be true so fast if you're doing that then the school or the institution will give you specific instructions on how to add them to your SOFAS account so that SOFAS will send it directly to the school right so this place it's like yes 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 and then continue they will prompt you again to check your name and your date of birth if you confirm then you go ahead right so what is left now is uh payments right and since i'm not going to apply for any graduate school again i'm not going to pay any money again right so um what i'm sure once you pay here it will just go to review and then it will give you the final instructions on what exactly to do so um this is how so uh, this is how world education services or world evaluation works um, hopefully I was able to to provide uh, some insights so um, once your account is set up you can go to account menu uh, check you know um, uh, your application track your package uh, your other history 
Uh, you can also check your timeline. Look at when you created the account. You can add your CV if you want. Uh, US application started, right? So um, view required documents. So once we go to view required documents, we will see exactly what we need to do academic transcript and degree certificates and also um if you haven't finished like in my case i can continue because i haven't paid and they want my money right so you can continue that um and then once the once the evaluation is done you will see that you would have um you would have a, a place that says check or check you know an electronic electronic format of your of your transcript right so this is how world uh, world education services or transcript evaluation services works i hope this helps um then remember to subscribe uh, share this with your with your friends um and all prospective applicants applying to graduate school in the u.s uh thank you so much